Good day. Uh, welcome back to this Skyrim playthrough. We are currently just standing right outside the quest area where we last, uh, Gearman's Hall, uh, where we last cleared things. And uh, today, as as we have done so far in this series, I don't really have a plan. So my plan previously was to speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. Um, I think we're going to still, you know, continue on in this direction and we'll just kind of see how far we get in the, uh, you know, half an hour or so that that we have to play. So, uh, I think our weight's still okay. Let me just check here. Yeah, I mean, it's not the greatest, but it's not terrible and I think... We can I've dump some back. on Lydia if we need to. Let's see here. I am at your command. Okay, so let's get that out of here. And I don't need a staff of courage on me, that's for sure. Uh, the Dwarven Sword. Did I want to keep that? I can't remember. It would let me use a shield, but no, nah, we'll just toss it on her for now. Uh, we're going to get rid of that bow for sure. And we're going to get rid of the Galder bow as well. There's not a whole lot. Huh, yeah. Galder Amulet Fragment. So this increases my stamina. So this is what we got last time was this, uh, this, uh, amulet. Um, that's kind of good. Stamina is, is kind of useful to me at this stage, but, um, I'm gonna just keep it, and I'm not gonna put it on Lydia, just because I don't remember, um, if I'm going to need that for anything kind of down the road, so... Okay, well that that drops us by like that it drops us to two hundred and nine. So uh, let's go ahead and just kind of continue on in this direction then. See how things go. Sorry, I just had to move my headset there. I don't know if that's gonna pick up, but if it does, that's what the whooshing sound was. Um, okay. Is this deep enough that I can swim in it? No, I can just kind of amble across it. Okay, cool, cool. Well, that probably means there's no slaughter fish in here, which is nice at least. Pretty calm, cool day, okay. Let's see. I could go there. I mean, what we're supposed to be doing is going that way, but like, that's right there. Look, it's a tower. There's probably something cool in the tower. Okay. What is that? Is that an island or... No, that's just the main, the main continent. Oh, hey, a boat. You know what? Let's go to the boat instead. Let's find out what's at, what's at the boat. Okay. Hey, people. Hey, I didn't even notice these people. Man, you're just sitting there. Whoa, hey, bad guy. People. Never should have come here. Oh, sure. Okay. Fine. Fine. These guys have like nothing on them, nothing at all. Okay, but they do have this unearthed chest. So, 30 gold, are you serious? Are you serious right now? That was not worth the effort to kill them. Like 100%, most definitely not worth it. Guess I'll take the mushrooms and stuff while I'm here though. I wonder if they have anything in their boat. Probably not. 
Salt is kind of nice. I do like that. Okay, well, that was certainly... That was certainly something. Let's save and then come up here. So, okay, this is where they were camping to try and find that treasure chest. I mean, feels like it was a pretty easy thing to find, so I'm not sure why they even had to set up a camp. Kind of feel like you could dig that up and get on the go again in like a day, but what do I know? Oh, hey, this might tell us something. So, island near the edge of the lake, look for a giant tree, that's where I buried it. Whoop de doo, buddy. 30 gold. Like, ridiculous. Ridiculous. That's like that meat that I just picked up was almost more expensive than the quote unquote treasure. Yeah, we'll take that. Why not? I am aghast at the paltry loot that was given to us. Um, okay, well, let's head on this way. You hey, there. there's a person there again. Traveler, over here. Vigilant of Stendar. Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> okay, sure. Okay, well, I guess Lydia, <laughs> Lydia did most of the work there. How come that one is all of a sudden naked? What happened? Oh, oh, I see. Okay, yeah. So let's take that and um, I already have one of those, so we don't need that. There's probably another Vigilant of Stendar somewhere around then, right? Because like they were both wearing, yeah, there we go. Okay, there's this guy and then she was in his stuff. Sneaky buggers. My goodness. These vampires. So what's that then? Do we think that's connected to the vampires at all? I don't know. Let's go up and check. We're, we're right here. You know? What's with the fog there? Is that Nernroot? Is this a garden of Nernroot? No way. Okay, that's unique. I don't remember. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Huh. What are you about to shoot at? Hey. <laughs> okay. That's, um, that's unique. So, <laughs> She just cut down the courier. I wonder if this dude had anything for me. And I wonder if they will send him out. Or like send out another one again. I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. Have that was heard? ruthless. There's been another dragon attack. I'm okay. Alright. Well. Oh. Man. What an adventure so far today. There's almost nothing ever in these, I don't think, but I like to check just in case. Uh, watermelons and gourds. Oh no, not watermelons, just gourds. Gotcha. What are these? Potatoes. Okay, that makes sense. That's a hoe. Alright. Uh, okay, so I can't... I mean, I could, but then the guard is just going to decide to try and muck with my day. I feel like I should just like harvest all of these that are here right now. Right? Because like, am I going to remember to come back to this place when I want to do... I think there's a Nern request to get like an adventure potion or some crap. But like, I'm never going to remember this, so I might as well just block all of those. Hmm. Alright, well. Okay. Let's go ahead and continue on. Find out what happens in this church. So I think we're just running through wind wilderness now, right? Ah. I keep 
pressing that, and I never, ever, ever mean to. Okay, it's telling me to go this way, which is kind of strange, because it looks like it's that way. I guess, okay, yeah, never mind. I was just pointing in slightly the wrong direction. That's my bad. cabin over there it looks like based on the icon in the hot bar there so I could kill that bunny but there's no point Uh, what this cabin or house or whatever is. We're getting close now. We're gonna find out right away. Wonder if there's uh, wonder if there's people to kill here. Okay. Oh, it's just ruined. It's like completely broken. Although there's still smoke coming out of the chimney, that's unique. Oh, we're detected. Okay, so something knows we're here. Oh, hey, it's just some old lady. Redwater den. Is it a vampire den? Is that what we've stumbled across? Well, let's just march boldly up and find out what they say. Look, I'm just here to keep watch. What, what I'm you're looking, looking for is, for is down, down inside. inside. Uh, bro, I have, uh, no idea what the hell I am looking for. I did not know that I was looking for anything. Okay, so the only way in is kind of through the side. You here for the skooma? Weird that you're standing around there inside as the... a trap door that'll lead you in. Here for skooma? Oh. So this is like a, a druggy den, eh? Hey? Okay, sure. Sure, How sure, do you sure. Feel? I think you might be sick. I got nothing on me. You think I might be sick? Oh, hey, I wonder. Uh, where do I see that? Active effects? Yeah. Okay. So because we got head on downstairs. because we messed with vampires, we have mm -hmm. that now. That's fun. I'll we'll take that because I like to collect skill books. Uh huh. I got nothing okay, so on. We're gonna have to remember. You're looking for skooma. Head on downstairs. I feel like this is a trap, you know. <laughs> um, we're gonna have to remember to deal with that uh, vampirism. I'm not super jazzed about being a vampire, if I can help it. <laughs> So are people going to try and kill me down here? Alden, if you're going downstairs, you keep your weapons, head on in, and behave yourself. I legitimately do not remember. I don't think I've ever done this before. Go on downstairs. You're bothering me. So, like, I am completely out of my depth here. Okay, well, I guess let's go downstairs. Let's see... I guess about the skooma den? Like, is this. Oh, hey, bro, is this where I chase the dragon? What's up? You seem tense. <laughs> Wait, you're serious? This is the Redwater Den, purveyors okay. of the best skooma out. And the secret is our mystic Redwater Spring. The magic in the waters opens the mind to experience skooma in a way like never before. Yeah, okay, sure. So it's your first time. Sure. Find a booth and Find enjoy. Booth. Okay. Great. So how do I get into this little... Okay, I have to be an expert. And I'm sure yeah, that as soon as I try, they will go place? ahead and attack me with everything they've got. Huh. Okay. <laughs> well, let's look around a little bit first. And then I guess let's do some drugs. Okay. Do you, Plate? 
Sweet. <laughs> this guy does not look like he's feeling so well. something hmm okay gotcha yeah so oh this person's just straight up dead okay cool yes that's that's my bad yeah okay what's in here another locked room And this is the shitter, so... Okay, Lydia, either come in or come out. Fucking doors, man. Uh, I guess let's sit with the Imperial Deserter and do some drugs. Alright, so... Pop this open. Uh, scrolls... Is it that potion? Would that be a potion? <laughs> Skooma. Right, that's that was really, really anticlimactic. Mm -mm. Okay. All right. So I feel like to do anything else in this place, we would have to like break into this and get into some shit. I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm just gonna try and remember to come back to this place. And uh, then eventually in the future, we will go ahead and tackle going through this scuba den. Vigilant of Stendar. How do you hey, feel? Please cure me. Stendar's light purify you of your ills. That's real handy. None Did you guys follow me into this All scuba den? Into the light. Hey, huh? get out of the way, please. Walk always. The mercy okay. of Stendar does not extend to death. Man, there are a lot of vampires all over the damn place, hey? Oh, hey, this is a useful ring. I like that. We'll take this stuff. None escape. Okay. All right. You guys aren't very good at your job. If hey you're there, just letting, friend. like, if you're looking for a fix, you're at the right place. You're just letting it's everybody in here. Door. Not very good at your job. Also, like, hey, listen, lookout person, there's no point in having a guy over here when your walls if you're buying, go are broken. On that Otherwise, doesn't make sense. You guys are terrible off. at this. Absolutely terrible. Okay, onward with more adventure. Fuck you. And fuck you. I think I saw another. I thought I saw another wolf over there, but maybe not. Okay, capture both of those wolf pelts. Okay, an unmarked dragon burial site, right? That's what this must be. This isn't the one that, yeah, no, we haven't been here before. Okay, did you, did you all see that goat just like disappear into here? He didn't run away when I was not looking, did he? Do I fall in here? No, okay, cool, 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 cool. What the hell? Oh my goodness, that was ridiculous. Cool. Those are some beefy spiders. Man, I had to shoot them a lot. My bow is not as strong as maybe it needs to be. But I feel like uh, the bow will serve me the best in the long run if I'm not going to, you know, revert to my old habits of just nuking things with magic spells. 
Which I still might. You, you never know. We might find ourselves in a place where uh, switching to casting is a smart thing to do. Oh, a Daedra. Uh, or not a Daedra. Spring it. Whoa. Okay. Uh, where did those... There's a lot of nasty things that she summoned. I'm pretty sure she summoned them, right? But draining the hell out of my health. Okay, so... Let's cheese that a little bit. And... I guess we'll go with... More archery. Critical shot or... Zoom. I do like that zoom, so let's get that right now. I don't know if that's like the most optimal option for right now, but anyway. Uh, where did you just? Okay, you are right there. Okay, so. There are other ones somewhere over there, I see. Okay. I'm just gonna jump down, I think, and take my chances, but it looked like there was... Aha, okay, a spider over there. I thought there was also some, like, saber tooth cats or something. somewhere but let's get the Spriggan's body if it's still around here somewhere. This tap root is always fun to have and uh yeah okay well we'll take that skull we'll use that when we start assassinating people for sure. Always do oh nasty ass spider Oh yeah, okay, there are safety cats. Good. <laughs> okay. Well, glad I wasn't insane. Okay, Lydia's got that one under control. Uh, oh, maybe she doesn't. What just hit me? Nothing? Nothing hit me? Okay. Alright. Uh... Is there anything else that is kind of in this area that we might want to take? Hmm. Nice little dead guy. Uh, is that another dead person? Jeez, I walked right over that person. That's already grilled, so we may as well. Oh, and a bear pelt. Yeah, we'll take that for sure. Uh, okay, so that's it, two dead people, got some spiders and stuff, and a wolf pelt, and the cat pelt, two cats, alright, that's not bad, hey look at that. All right. Well, uh, I definitely have to do something about my stopping power. The rate at which I kill things is not very good. If I didn't have a companion right now, I would be sorely, sorely pressed to not die. Which we are going to try our best not to do. Okay, what's over there? Is that okay, just a random shack on the water? 
probably got something to do with the city. Right? Yeah, we can assume that. Oh, nice big boat. Cool. Alright, so... Seriously? Where did they come from? Did I miss them? Did, did I just like walk right past a bunch of wolves and not even pay attention? My situational awareness in this game is going to get me killed, apparently. As it is freaking terrible. I've been looking for you. Sweet. Looks like that's it. Got to okay. Go. Just says items added. <laughs> no indication of what you gave me. Cool. Um that would be less of a pain in the butt if we didn't... Is it the dinner invitation? What is this? Quarterly invited to dinner and drinks at Bloodchill Manor. Oh, as if that's not an ominous name. As an honored guest, you're encouraged to come early and mingle with the other attendees. When you're ready to feast, ask the house waiter for a menu and he will let you into the banquet hall. Finest and most delectable dishes will be on display. No need for appetite. Once everyone is ready and seated, a full course awaits. Okay, that's a trap, right? Like, very clearly, that's a trap. Um, okay. I don't think I've read this before. Uh, Valkyrie, the fame of your exploits across Skyrim brought you to my attention. I don't have many exploits, so I don't know what the hell this guy's smoking, but uh, let's see. Okay. Alright. And is there anything else? Have I read the mysterious note? Yeah. Okay, so I've read that. Let's check this. Uh... Huh? Okay, and oh, that was the wrong button. Okay, so we were on the second, the second note. Okay. All right. Okay, that's the one that we had already seen. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think that's everything then. So we have. Trouble been invited to dinner and we've been invited to go see the Jarl because apparently we're super famous Woohoo! at like a level 11 or 12 or whatever that seems outlandishly implausible to me but hey you know I guess it's possible okay let's get the stables because that's gonna be useful for us later um hold them hmm. before i let you into riften for the privilege of entering the city what does it matter uh, i don't want to tell a guard that i'm gonna kill him but like it's oh, obviously a ship voice down. down you want everyone okay. to hear you yeah that's you win. that's uh that's part and parcel for your city i guess <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and maybe what we'll do is we'll sell some stuff here uh, and then we will carry on towards being a vampire hunter uh, in the next episode as I see we're hitting the 30 minute mark on this one so with the thief's guild. Be careful, Mio. yeah okay the oh right guild thieves guild this is Black where Briar the thieves guild back. stuff is I don't know you you and Riften look yeah well I got Last thing the Blackbriars need is some stranger stick. The Blackbriars have rifted in their pocket, and the Thieves Guild watching their back. Me? I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Uh, then we're speaking the same. So what do you want to know? Um, okay, I don't actually want to know seeing you literally around. anything from you. Don't care. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. Okay. When you borrowed Sapphire. from me, you said you'd pay it back on time. I think she's a... 
Do you get her as a companion? I forget. I Maybe there's a quest to get her. Next time, keep your plans okay. quiet, and nothing will I think it's a quest. Be and Barb. And this is the market, right? But it's probably too early to actually sell or buy anything. So, uh, now that we're in town, what we'll do is I will call it a... Uh, I will call it a day here. We will follow up on some of these threads uh, next time. I don't time. have any business with you, so get and... out of my face. Uh, we'll continue on trying to learn how to be vampire hunters because that feels huh? like it could be fun. What do you want? I owe a great deal of money. To uh, I was able to work. I borrowed some. Now Sapphire wants her money back, and if I don't pay, oh, I'm wish not I could help you, buddy. Sorry as I am. Okay. Yep, that's it for me tonight. Uh, have huh? a great day. Happy what do you gaming. Want?